Hello, today we're going to make an explosion effect in Scratch. As you can see, if you click, an explosion will happen. And it looks very nice and smooth. So let's get started. First, paint a sprite. Name it Explode. Now, use the circle tool. Make the fill uh, a yellow color. Now, press shift and make a square. Make sure there's no outline. Make the, make it a good size. Now, name it fire. Duplicate this and name it dust. And make it, make the size bigger. And make it a good size. Now, make the fill a gray color, a lightish gray color. Now, when green flag clicked, hide. Then, forever, then a if, mouse down. Then, wait until not mouse down. Oops, not mouse down. Make a new block. Name it, name it, explode. Run without, run without screen refresh. Now, put the explode here. And in the explode block, go to mouse pointer then switch costume to fire then repeat pick random 50 to 60 then set size to pick random 85 to 110 then point in direction pick random 0 to 360 and make a new variable named named explosion power for this sprite only make another variable named type for this sprite only as well make sure they're all for this sprite only now up here uh, under the fire switch costume to fire set type to fire now set explosion power in here to pick random 10 to 30 and then lastly create a clone of myself now right click on this block and duplicate and put it here oh and make sure it's the create a clone of myself is in here same for this one now, switch, switch this, switch the costume to dust for this bottom one, and switch type to dust. Make sure it's the same name as the costume. Now, repeat 40 to 100 times, and then the size will be 10 to 150 the direction will be the same and here will also be the same now when I start as a clone show then uh, if else if 
if type equals fire make make sure it's the same as this you can you can select this and copy and pastel it in but make sure it's the same and then the if in this part do a repeat until explosion power equal wait under explosion power under one so explosion power less than one make sure the arrow for this is pointing to the explosion power now for the fire change color by pick random minus 0 0.1 to minus 1.25 then set explosion power by explosion power times 0 0.82 now move by explosion power then change y by a 2 and lastly change change ghost by 1 duplicate this and put it into else then we change this to instead of color we put it here and make it brightness and no not have that then change brightness by minus three and ghost by 1.5 and turn turn this way turn right by Pick random minus twenty to twenty. Now repeat five times. Change ghost by twenty and duplicate this turning script and put it here now change also duplicate the change y by 2 and put it here and lastly delete this clone at the bottom now if you start and click as you can see it will create a explosion effect and also if the brightness is going way too dark then make it make the brightness change brightness by minus one now as you can see there is explosion effect and also change the explosion power for the for the dust by zero point Eight, eight. Now, if you test it, as you can see, it will create nice explosion particles. And if you want it to be less small, you can change that to less. As you can see, this is the explosion effect. And now you have the explosion effect. Thank you for watching and have a fantastic day.